Hey, Brad. Hi. I'm Man. here reporting in live from Gamescom. Hello, German Ben. Auf Wiedersehen. No, that's goodbye. I don't know how to say hello. Ben, ben auf Deutsch. Guten Tag. Guten Tag, that's right. Uh, well, Morgan. Guten Tag and welcome to Trials. This is the new Trials. It is... Uh, trials Yorkers. Trials Yorkers, yeah. Finally. Uh, I'm not in Gamescom, but I uh, got a chance to play this ahead of time. And this is some footage here. We're not playing live, but yo, they yes. made trials. Whoa, I like trials. Yeah, I'll play some trials. And although I can't, whoa, wow. It's yeah, oh. right out the gate. Uh, this is trials. Yeah. Um, so we briefly saw in that overworld there. They kind of have an ascending scale of easy to hard. This is one of the easier tracks, and. Yeah, they kind of, they, they, they added, they eventually in the Trials series added, you know, a trick system and some other things that people were kind of hot and cold on. Yeah, the tricks were not. Not the greatest thing, you know, for a game that's so physics-y and built, so, that's really like a puzzle game more than anything, um, like a physics puzzle. Yeah, it was, it was an okay idea, like the, the way they handled it was interesting, but it, yeah, it's just not really in the spirit of the game. Uh, but they're back to basics on this one. Um, with some new twists that we'll show off later here, but yeah, kind of right out the gate, it's it's trials. Um, <laughs> it sure did look like a trial. Story. And there I go, exploding Wait, at the end. Was it that mosaiced out? I don't. Or was that a video? Think, I don't think that was supposed to happen. <laughs> it was like this is a censored explosion. Um, so uh, do they have a. Oh man, I'm embarrassed to admit I don't remember if they had that leveling system. No, is that or, I don't know if there was leveling, but the loot system like is you, you definitely mm -hmm. unlock bikes yeah. and stuff. But that was like preset. I think every few tracks or something is this. Was this that like is a random drop thing. It it seems progressive. It seems like you are unlocking. Um, so you unlock things for tracks, such as you know gear, um, those little poses that you see there. Um, skins for bikes and stuff like that. And then you're also upgrading, or you're getting unlocks per level. Okay. Um, as in the level that you are. So like level two, level three. Uh, and you know, you get more experience. So you're racing against multiple people. Uh, you do not have to beat them to win, to beat a track. But uh, if you want a medal, you know, you have to First place gold, second place silver, etc. Is that the kind of the default mode to always have ghosts? Yeah. It's, oh, really? Okay, so that's new because you know there were ghost modes in the past, but they were not like the mode. Right. Yeah. So this seems to be kind of the standard, or at least that's what they had me playing, and didn't say there were other options. Um. So yeah, it, it's uh, as far as far as trials goes, it feels just like how I remembered it. Um, it took me like oh. one track oh. to get oh. used to it. Oh. And then uh, from there on, it was just getting used to the motherfucking trials puzzles. Yeah. Uh, trials is great. Yeah. And terrible. Yeah. Oh, it's so frustrating because it's so easy to just restart right at that checkpoint and fail and fail and yeah. fail and well, fail. Well, that's crucial if you couldn't restart in a split second. Yeah. <laughs> Who would play this game? <laughs> we will see. Um, a great example of that, and I think the next track. But so yeah, this is this is kind of the main mode. You know, there, there's um, you're kind of going around the world, start out in America and progress east. Um, is there like a theme to it? Because the last Trials Fusion was the bizarre futurist thing with an AI talking to you and like a lot of weird. No, this seems, stuff. this seems to be more of like, hey, just go. You're going around the world, and each of the like cities is very like in the France stage. You're going up the Eiffel Tower. Okay. You know, um, not, not quite so high concept with this one. No, uh, these beginning levels didn't really have like a hard theme either, like other than city or city skyline. Uh, I'm gonna double check here and see if they have a date for this game, but it seems like it's it's next year. I think it's like February. Pretty much uh, done as far as games go. There's uh, four different bikes that you can choose from at the start. There's the standard bike, the Mantis, which has like more control. Uh, there's like the Rhino, which is fast because it has more top speed. And then the tandem bike, which is new to this game. Uh, Trials Rising comes out in 2019. Oh no! That's right. 
Is it February, I think? Yeah. Uh, it just feels, Trials is great because it feels like, even though you don't know what's ahead of you, like, so this part, I just know, okay, I'm gonna keep driving forward and that's probably gonna launch me and I'm probably gonna need to land on a ramp. So it's nice because you, you understand what the game can throw at you pretty quick when you pick it up, right? Like, it's gonna be ramps and jumps and that's kinda it with some variants. But it's more of like reacting to and perfecting your routes uh, more than anything. Noch in Entwinklung. I'm not sure what that's. Uh, little... That means love to race. Watermark. Huh, so I, yeah, I think named characters is also new. Yeah, they don't really have like a huge presence in the game. Uh, they might, you know, uh, who's to say if there's some sort of story that they haven't showed off yet, but. Um, the tandem bike, that's the last new thing. Uh, there's no footage of that in oh, here, bummer. which is a shame. Yeah, but that sounds like the most ridiculous thing in this whole game. Yeah, it's two players with full control over the bike, and uh, they, they it, say does that... Does it show up as, is, is it a literal tandem bike with two people on it, or yeah. is it just, okay? Uh, it's like longer, you know? Okay. It's just got two people on it, and you uh, apparently, ha it's the fastest bike. You can go, they said 120% speed compared to any other bike. Oh god, this this is the course. This is... Uh, <sighs> I just I find myself tense. I'm not even the one playing. Yeah. I'm like tensing up every yep. time. You oh, just when that back wheel comes off the ground uh, and you just don't... I hope you like looking yep. at Egypt. There it is. Oh, oh. Well, I got... I hit okay. the checkpoint. I... Uh, God, I feel like such a goober every time I just barely like crash across <laughs> one of the checkpoints. Yeah. Like, I feel like it shouldn't count. I think this is it. Um, fairly generous uh, checkpointing. It's kind of like in these early stages, you're like one obstacle, and then you get to a checkpoint. Uh, later stages are more difficult. <sighs> yeah. There was um, one of the developers, or, or community, I think he was actually in the community for the game, was watching me play and. He very kindly, he, he said, I don't want to be a uh, backseat gamer, but if you uh, need some help, let me know. And so I tried this for a little while, and eventually I caught his eye and called him over and, and said, hey, can you help me with this one? And he said, oh, yeah, I'm actually really bad at ah, this one. That's good to hear. Yeah. It makes me feel a little better. You can tell I get a little frustrated here, maybe, and, and oh, not yeah. quite thinking about my approach yep. as much as I could be. <laughs> yeah, this, this game will put you on tilt in record time for sure. Um, worth noting, every time you hit that restart button, you're adding five seconds to your total time. Wait, really? Yeah. Is that new? I think that's new. I don't remember. So you can see that I've had 27 resets. Oh, and that'll cash in at the end? Yeah. Oh, wow. I feel like that's new. Yeah, I couldn't remember. I mean, it seems like, yeah, they're maybe getting a little more harsh about their scoring system with, uh, you know, with all this ghost stuff. Yeah. Wait, are there ghosts active on this track right Yes, now? they are. Where so you are can they? see on the top right that oh, they kind of progress finished. bar. Ah. Um, that's really shitty. I mean, that's good, but yeah, it's good it, to see their progress, but it's shitty to see, like, ah, oh, they finished already. Yeah, and but you know, that kind of has a nice little thing of like, okay, once you figure out the course, then you can become competitive with the ghosts and, and try and outrank them. <laughs> Thinking about rage quitting, and I figure, you know, maybe I'll just restart it because some of them, uh, they mentioned, you know, going in with momentum makes it easier. Sure. Uh, plus those ghosts had all finished and I was ashamed. Um, yep. They said the ghosts are real players' uh, ghosts. And that you'll see, like, gamer tags in there, and they pull ghosts from people who have similar skill levels to you, like, based on their internal matchmaking. Uh, system. Oh! Yeah, uh, motherfucker, first wow, try. man, okay. Yeah, jeez, huh? Uh, and at that point, it didn't even matter if I crashed. I was riding that high. Um, the bikes do really feel different. Like that Mantis bike, I can't remember if that's the one I'm using on this one. It really is like a hairpin control on the tilting. Yeah. <laughs> yep. God, it's so satisfying. I 
think I'm ready for another trial. Oh, I'm totally, yeah. It's been a while. Playing it was, it was one of those things of just right, like two minutes into the first track, I was, I was ready for it to be out and in my hands for real. Like I love Trials HD so much. And then I think it was Trials Evolution after that. Yeah, I can't also remember if great. Fusion or Evolution was I think it was there. Evolution and then Fusion. I don't think I'm forgetting one. By the time they got to Fusion, I was like, okay, that's a lot of Trials, so okay. Yeah. But that was a good... And then there was like, you know, Joe Danger and a couple other games that tried to do a yeah, Trials-like no, Nothing thing. has quite scratched the Trials itch, though. No. Like like these games, but... Uh, but I, I, you know, I imagine like the success of getting over it and other physics-based puzzlers that yeah. we've seen a lot of have people ready to slam their keyboards <laughs> and faces into their monitors for a new Trials game. I just, I, I wonder if Red Lynx will ever make anything else, though. Oh, have they not done? Uh, not that I'm aware of. I mean, you know, Ubisoft is a huge company. They, sure. might, they might work on other stuff. Right. With other studios? I don't know, but like the... I think all the products with their names kind of front and center have all been Trials games since they got bought. Uh, it's tough, I mean... Like Trials is a great concept, but it's kind of a one-note concept. <laughs> nice. Yeah. Uh, uh, you can hit tough. Y to bail out. Okay. Yeah. I'm sure it's I'm sure it's hard to keep making these games and come up with new things to add besides sure. just like here's some more tracks. Yeah, like like you can imagine by the time they got to that third game, they just had to add something. Yeah, else. I'm sure I'm sure that's where the that's how the trick system came about. But, uh, yeah, it's a good old back to basics trials game. I could get into that. Uh, it's worth noting that this is a considered a medium out of like easy, medium, hard, extreme, and impossible. Yeah. I played, uh, I didn't get it on footage because it was uh, after the capture had kind of run out, but they were talking, uh, they had me try the Mount Everest stage, which is the only like insane one unlocked, and I could not get past the first yep. obstacle. Yep, I remember those. So at this point they told me to kind of use the physics of the ropes to kind of rock the... Oh, interesting. Uh, that platform a little bit. Do you want to like kind of bounce off of it? Yeah, or like if you hit it with your back wheel, you can kind of edge it forward. Like if you hit the oh, make it swing. Yeah, so you see how closer? it's kind of like little. It's Dude, it's very is... slight, but it's enough to get you there. Yep, <laughs> you got there. For the record, I will make this jump eventually. Oh. God. That construction worker just patronizing me every time I restart. Okay. I'm feeling myself on this one. Okay. Nope. Nope. Yeah, I remember playing the Flash. Oh, got it. Yep, that counts. <laughs> the Flash version of Trials, like on Shockwave.com or one of those equivalent sites back in high school. Was that just called Trials? Yeah. The same people, right? Same everything? I think so. I, I didn't know much about the pedigree going in, but... Like, I know when, when Trials HD came out, like, people knew what Trials was. Like, you know, it yeah. a thing. I had never heard of it before. That was my first exposure to it. But... Um, they mentioned that there, so you can, you know, you can propel yourself off the bike uh, with Y, and I heard somebody else asking why you would ever do that, and they mentioned that there are secrets that you can maybe only access as a body. Yeah, they've done a lot of that stuff over time, and I've never gotten super deep into it. No. Yeah, didn't, didn't one of those Trials games have like a really crazy... A complex hidden Easter egg thing oh. that was like nice. Oh, there, there's been a lot of that else, stuff. But. Yeah, there's been a lot of that stuff where you would have to like ditch off the bike at the right spot. There's like squirrels to collect and yeah. like, weird stuff like that. I almost want to say Fusion had some spots that eh, I started to say like alternate exits in some levels. I might be misremembering. That's a weird game. God, this. 
Just one last little, you know, one last fuck you. So you have those contracts, you see it says contract failed, and it's usually like, get bronze or get silver, and that, or it might be, you know, like, don't crash, or, and those are unlocking pieces of loot. Oh, that's right, they had some of that stuff in, uh, I forget how they incentivized it, but they had some of that stuff in Fusion where it would be like, uh, be like, get through the level without steering, or without leaning, like, yeah. like you basically just can only accelerate, or like, Get through the level without without ever letting off the accelerator. Oh God! Just stuff like that. Yeah, all the ones they showed were very basic, like um, place, basically place. Uh, uh, get a medal. Does that get you like extra XP? Uh, I can't remember if it was extra XP or uh, just a straight up piece of loot. It's got multiplayer. They didn't talk much about it, but they did oh, you know God. talk about how it has online uh, modes from multiple people. It's just so frustrating. And I was the one playing it and it's frustrating. <laughs> All right. Sweet. The rest of this is a cakewalk. I was hoping. <laughs> and I get crushed. So I think the next thing here is, is the big new feature that they've added in this game. I have to see. Licensed music. Yeah, here we go. So they have these um, stadium, uh, I, I forgot the name of them, but they're like stadium events and they're heats basically um, where you are trying to finish in the top half basically of multiple events back to back. And they're all in the same kind of, they're not all on the same stage, but they're in the same location. So this one's a monster truck uh, park. Okay. Um, Still pulling in ghosts. Yeah. Ghost runs. Yep. Real ghosts from real players. I like that they plug the, uh, their little subreddit down there. That's, you know, smart for community. Hmm. I, I like when they, like, I mean, Fortnite uh, devs are very active in their community and it shows, you know, people like that sort of stuff. So yeah, I guess less ghosts and more just actual, you know. Straight up bikes in there. Yeah. It did get a little confusing at certain points, but you know, since you're on the foreground, it's not that bad. And every time you reset, like, everyone just moves forward a little bit. You know, it's not like an automatic you hit B and everyone's in the same place, like people will go a little further. They kind of play it out, basically, those, as those seconds that you lost. Like in real time? Yeah. Okay. So for, you know, for the first heat, you just have to get top four, and then four people are eliminated. It goes okay, until so there's one person left. So it's just kind of fake multiplayer? Yeah. And so you do them each individually, and each has their own um, medal. And then at the end, you do them all in a row. And you, basically, if you lose one, you have to restart the whole thing. I was unable to do it. <laughs> do all three back to back. It was very difficult. So wait, is this still part of the same heat or whatever? Like uh, no, you, you basically get to, well, you have to clear them all individually once. And they oh, each oh, have their oh, own. Like standalone? Yeah, and then you and do then all three combined. Them all together? I yeah. See. Is there like low time in between, I assume? Yeah. Or, okay. It's short. Not too bad. Yeah, the game feels very snappy. The short load times uh, they seem uh, to be really taking advantage of the new consoles. like five years old almost. Yeah. Got it. <laughs> this is one of those instances where braking would come in handy. Like, you don't really want to be in the air that much. Does this game even have brakes? Oh, totally. Does it? Yeah, and it's important to use huh. them, I guess, because you know, the less time you're spending on a huge jump, like more than you need to, that's the less time you're on the yeah, ground no, that's, going yeah, fast. Yeah, that's, that's fair. I guess I probably knew that at one point, but... <laughs> 
not sure if I've ever used them. So I could get that little rubber duck floating around. I didn't, they didn't uh, have us jump into the customization stuff, but I assume, you know, there's X number of slots, like outfit, helmet, bike, pose, and buddy. I like this one because you ride on a monster truck at one point. It's like a truck graveyard. That's <laughs> where the grave diggers from. I like the yelling. I like the like fake woo. Yeah, this game or this series just has like a lot of attitude. Yeah. But in a way that's so dumb you can kind of be okay with it. Yeah, it's attitude and then but like they all explode at the end. Like it knows how stupid it <laughs> yeah. is. Trials is very aware of how dumb it is. And then, yeah, so you get this last little heat. It's uh, probably the shortest of three, and then you just run those three back to back to back. Uh, and is all the scoring for all these runs kind of cumulative? Or, uh, or it's just an elimination thing, right? Yeah. So everybody that makes it to the last heat kind of competing there. Yeah, because there's no, there's not really like any mid heat ranking. Um, it's just you either make it to the last heat or you don't. Yep. I think we... I assume it has like real actual live multiplayer too, right? Yes, okay. totally. They just didn't have, and the tandem stuff too. So like, I wonder if you could even do two tandems. Um, that might be crazy, but whoa! Yeah, this is the this is one of the easier tracks. This is the one they were like had you know their local leaderboard and stuff, and we're challenging people to get the high score on. I just really like this one visually. It's probably my favorite. It's kind of like a Universal Studios yeah. vibe to That's it. That's cool. Yeah, have you riding on a roller coaster? It's a good concept. Yeah. the best unused trials track idea. Live football game. Okay, that's all right, sure. Um, i trying to think of something that has a lot of, like, hazards. I would like to see a level pack where they go full level lord and just oh, be, yeah. like, tiny bikes in, like, a kid's bedroom <laughs> or the kitchen. The bathroom. Yeah, that could be a whole thing. Just the whole house. Just every room in the house has a track. <laughs> I'm sure I, I have to imagine they'll do a whole crap ton of level packs for this thing. They put out so much Fusion DLC. Yeah, way I, more than I was ready for. Yeah, I had the season pass for that thing and I just, yeah, like I kind of stopped at some point. I think they put out a whole second game's worth of, of levels. Yeah, and then uh, Whoa. I, think, I think this is the last track. You just get launched. I was so worried that I was doing something wrong or I had to make a jump or something, but nope, it just launches you. That's a, yeah, that's a cool looking level. But yeah, so that's, I mean, hey, it looks that, like Trials. That is some Trials ass Trials. Smells like Trials. I can say from experience, this is a Trials game. And uh, yeah, it comes out next year. Cool. And the beta actually starts really soon. Oh, so okay. there's like a closed beta going on. I'm sure you can find out more info somewhere, oh. but. Oh, that's the end of our footage. Yeah, and that's Trials. That's the end of the video, thank you. Thanks, Brad.